Start by downloading Fabric Loader, download for Windows and save it to the desktop. I leave a link to that site, double click on the Fabric installer, select the version which you want, I want 1.21, so select it and click on install. It successfully installed, so click on ok and close it. Now download the Fabric API, click on files, search for your version, in my case 1.21, so click on the three dots and click on download file. I leave a link for all of that, save to the desktop, now download Distant Horizon, I leave a link for that, click on files, search for your version, very important to be fabric, so make sure that you download the fabric version, click on the three dots and click on download file. Save to the desktop, open Minecraft and now you have to run the game for one time on the fabric loader profile. If you didn't have it here, go to installation, new installation, select it from here and click on create. So just run the game, click on play. In Minecraft, click on Options, Resource Packs and Open Pack Folder. Here click on that Minecraft and search for mods. If you didn't have that folder, just create it and name it exactly like that mods. Double click on that, we can close the Minecraft. Now select the two mods which we download, right click on that, click on Copy, go into the files and click on Paste in the mods files and run again Minecraft. On the fabric loader click on play, play again. Now create a world or join to your world. Click on options and here is the distant horizon. If you click on that you see that here we have selected 128 chunks. That's a huge distance but also you can turn off the mod and turn on the mod. But it's very important to have a bit more RAM in the games. The 2GB which is the default is maybe not enough so I recommend you to close the game and here into the launcher go to the installations and in the fabric loader click on the three dots, click on edit, click here more options and here down I recommend you to change that too into more RAM. For example 4 GB of RAM is better than 2, so after that click on save and run the game with 4 GB. And now with 4 GB the game will be better, so now for the beginning you will have to stay in a single location and wait for around 20 or 40 minutes, it depends on your PC to render that 128 chunks. So that's how the 128 chunks are look like. We can see so far and we have a better experience with the entire game without having any big impact on the PC performance. Click here 